Hey guys, okay, what's up? Um, I'm not doing introductions anymore. I really hate it. It's like annoying, like get to the fucking point. I don't give a shit about your stupid introduction, like shut up. I need to get the fuck out of here, okay? Like I need to get out of the States. I feel like I need to do something. I like, I wish she was like six months so I could just like up and like go and like go to Europe and just go to Europe. But I feel like it's just too early. I don't wanna take her this soon, obviously. But I feel like at six months, it'd be cool. So, and by the way, that noise. Okay, stop. Like, I literally turned this video on to film and then like gardeners are here and they're not even here on this property. I don't know where they are, but they just love to come and film or they love to come and turn their blowers on or whatever it is when I'm filming. Okay, and I don't want to scream today because there's construction workers here and it's just like awkward and can we not have a day of peace? Do you know what I mean? Okay, stop. So today I'm making a salad, okay? I am making a French salad, okay? And I know you little fucking white trash, either white trash rats who haven't even fucking been out of the States, you don't even know what a fucking plane is, or some fucking Euro trash is gonna be like, that's not a French salad. Okay, yes, it is a French salad. First of all, if it's not a French salad, I'm saying it's a French salad to so shut up, okay? I don't need you to, a little trash, rat trash, to tell me what's French and what's not, okay? Because I'm telling you it is, so shut up. Like, you know what I mean? Like, who are you? Okay, like who the fuck are you to tell me something? It's very irritating and dumb and you look like a fool. Okay, so we're making a French salad today and um, I've been wanting to make the salad so I've been like saving it for, to do with you guys. And yesterday was funny yesterday. And by the way, I hate this fucking brush. Um, I have like a thousand HRH brushes. I can't find one of them. I don't know where they are. They're like probably in the car. And um, this one just does not sleek my hair the way HRH brush does. And it just is shit, okay? So I'm not loving my look right now, which is also very, like seriously pissing me off, okay? Anyway, so I'm making a French salad. And I said it, yes, I'm gonna say it again. I'm making a French salad, okay? And I know it's gonna irritate you guys because you love to tell me what I do is not what I do or whatever it is. Like you try to discredit everything I do, but I don't care because duh, okay. Anyway, so funny story though actually real quick yesterday when I went, I went to Whole Foods to get some stuff to make the salad and um this woman it was like I had the baby with me yes I bring my baby with me if I go to the grocery store we go get coffee we just go for like little johns if I had to go to Neiman Marcus to pick up my Chanel sneakers I brought her with like oh you think I'm gonna be a jungle mother sitting at home with milking tits in a fucking like in a robe all day long is that what you think no I have to go to work okay I have to do things and she can come with me that's what I do okay like I'm not a, and I'm not disgusting fat okay jungle mother sitting at home um in tears that's you okay so do you see what I mean? Like, we just don't, we're just not the same. We are not the same. You're a jungle mother, okay? And I'm not, okay, so that's the thing. And the thing is like, the rats have turned into jungle mothers because now they're like, I've got a whole other like slew of like rat turds on my, on my account here. And the new rat turds, like with feces in their assholes, are jungle mothers who have gained 75 pounds, who are sitting home with milking tits, okay, just not getting it together. And yes, I do breastfeed. Do you see what I mean? Like, I it's, I don't understand. I, I just, I can't relate, okay? Yes, I have nails on. I will always have nails on. Anyway, so yesterday I went, okay, so it's really funny. When you are, people love babies. I don't love babies. I love my baby, of course. Um, but I'm not the kind of person who like sees a baby out and it's like, oh my gosh, like I just don't. I see that with like dogs, like puppies or like cats or something or like an any animal, you know what I mean? But like, I've never like thought, oh my gosh, like to someone else who has like a baby, oh my God, a, a newborn. Like I just don't, I'm not like a baby person. I'm not like a child person, you know that. Like, like children should be seen and not heard. You may love your child. I don't love your child. You know what I mean? I love my own child. So that's just how I am. Okay, like children are typically gross. So anyway, um, Liliette is not gross. Liliette is the vibe. Like, she really is. Okay, that's a whole other story. And by the way, no, I'm not bringing Liliette on here because I just feel like there's too many rat turds. Like, I don't want to, like, infest my little child. Do you know what I mean? Like, she, she doesn't deserve it. So, like, yeah, I'll show pictures on Instagram or whatever, but, like, I wouldn't... I feel like bringing her on here, there's that movie. Do you guys... Okay, I don't want to bring it up. It's so disgusting. I, like, got... When I was in my first trimester, I just was, like so sick you guys know that so i just like put movies on to like, try to distract myself even though i hate movies there's this most disgusting despicable psycho like it's a ho like hollywood leftist psychotic crazy shit like the fact that someone could even come up with this they are so sick like they actually need to be like there's something wrong with them like they're going to hell um uh, who is in it Lawrence, Jennifer Lawrence or whatever. And it's about, literally, I had no idea what this was about. It was the dumbest movie ever. 
it like dragged and in the end it turned into like baby sacrifice like it was so horrific and meanwhile i'm like fucking in my first trimester watching this i was disgusted and i was just so this is why i hate hollywood like it's so gross anyway i feel like you guys give that okay a lot of you rats with the turds out there that's the vibe you give like that movie is the vibe you give and no i wouldn't recommend watching it it's not worth it it's like so boring and in the end is just like so foul that like i don't even know how someone could even film this or even want to be in that in that like it's actually sick okay anyway that's what you guys are giving anyway back onto the whole foods thing so i'll go to whole foods and i like <sighs> see this is how my hair should look all the time and I want to get like a green juice and they, I get like the, whatever the green, like the low calorie one. And I have the baby in the carrier and she's like small, I guess. Like, and, um, I have like, you know, of course I want my, my jewelry and I'm like, I, I look snatched. Yes, I do. You guys know you cannot deny it. You can't deny it. I know you wanted me to get fat and I did it. Fuck you. Okay. I love it. Um, you were waiting for me. Okay. So I'm snatched. And I look like this and I have a baby. I look like I have fucking hired a surrogate. That's what I do. I look so good. Look at my stomach. I look so good. It's white as fuck. Yeah, I gotta get tan. I look like, it, people are probably like she had a surrogate. Like that's how good I look. It's true, okay? Cause I see moms walking around. They don't look good. No, they don't, okay? They look raggedy as hell and you just wouldn't know. But you guys know I did not have a surrogate. I fucking pushed the thing out myself and I should post that video of me pushing it out because I have a video, but I won't. Okay. So anyway, um, and okay, so I go to get the green, green juice and the, the girl, like the, there's two like girls working back there and one of them's like, oh my gosh, the baby or whatever. And I was like kind of dumbfounded because like, I was like, I don't know. It's just like not something I would do like, cause I don't care about kids. So whatever. Anyway, I was like, yeah, like, how old is she? And I was like, oh, almost, I think like two and a half weeks. And they're like, oh my gosh. And I was like, yeah, I know she comes with me just a little places here and there to do things so I can get things done and they're like she's like wow you're up out and about you know nails and I was like yeah I'm not really gonna change my life you know for the baby she's good like they weren't trying to be mean I was just like yeah bitch like I'm gonna take my nails off for a baby and I'm gonna like what do you why why you know what I mean the only thing I'm gonna do is these are really grown out I'm going to shorten the thumbs because I can't push the car seat button the release easy so I'm having to like use my knuckle it's just annoying so I'm gonna make these a little bit shorter I'm not gonna make them short I'm gonna make them shorter okay so anyway and then I was walking around in like the vegetable section and this like lady who works there came up she's like oh my gosh a baby like the another two people oh my gosh a baby so cute like like what I don't know I don't know I'm I guess I'm the odd one out where I don't like like babies don't do it for me unless it's my like I told you unless it's my baby like like other people's children others other children others children's others children don't do it for me and then this whatever the worker one of the workers like i saw you in here before i was like oh my gosh i, I would yeah so i must have been pregnant and she's like yeah and then it was funny that i had like the baby so anyway it was just funny to me that like she recognized me as being in there before but not being pregnant or being pregnant and then i had the baby with me okay so we're making a French salad today, you dumb fucks. And for those of you who can try, who try to act like you know everything about, because every time we bring up something about Europe, like Europe or whatever, the rats are rampant. Okay, like they start scratching at the windows. Like I swear to God, there's like an infestation. It really bothers them. It's like the Dior stroller. They can't handle it. There's something about there's certain triggers with these rats. They just can't. Okay, so anything that's like. Um, with Europe, you guys have, you have to like shut me down. I could literally tell you this, the sweatshirt is from Europe and you would like, they would say something, they can't handle it. Like I, I they, they can't handle it. Okay, so it's funny. Anyway, so we're making a French salad, I said it a million times. And then, um, okay, so that's what we're doing. I love it and I love all these ingredients. Sorry, it was, that sounded like a fart, it wasn't. It was the stool, okay. I don't know if it did or didn't, but anyway. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with these um, butter, let me show you guys what I'm doing. So it's like butter greens. And I'm going to show you guys my plate too, because if you guys know me by now, if you've been following my channel for a long time, you know that everything I have is very thought out. Like I, I would never in a million years eat off of a plate that was like, unapp like unappetizing. Like everything has to be um, right. Okay. Or it's just not, I, my hair is like really bothering me, you guys. I'm sorry. Like, and I know you're going to get mad at me for brushing my hair over the food. I already told you a million times, I don't care, this is my food. I'm going to fl flip out. I've already flipped out a million times. This, I'm cooking for myself, okay? This is not a restaurant, stop. Okay, so snap peas, 
um, a light lemon, um, light, light lemon and olive oil dressing, cucumber, dill, and smoked salmon lox, okay? I love lox so much, I love it. And this salad is very French. I also got some potatoes to cut, which we'll do. This is the plate. It's really important that you choose um, a plate that is white and bold, but shallow, okay? Like, and it needs to be, um, it needs to be big, okay? And needs to have this shape. Okay, this is from uh, Crate and Barrel. So, and it was not expensive. You can go to see, find it. Okay. So I don't wash greens that are like packaged like this. I don't, I don't, I actually don't even wash. Like I really don't even wash my berries a lot. Like I don't care. I am 40 years old and I've survived till now. Can you believe that I have purchased greens that are previously washed and packaged and I have survived until 40 years old? Get off of my page with your shit about washing greens. This is not the romaine lettuce from fucking what's it called? I don't even know. Smart and final, which you guys are going to. These are nice greens, they don't need to be washed. I don't care, okay? I don't have time to wash greens. I'm not buying, if it was like romaine that were like in the fridge section, Yes, I would wash them. These are packaged. It's different. I don't care. Shut up. You guys are going to come from everything. So I have to see what I mean. I have to always, I might have to be one step ahead of you. Be one step ahead of your ass. It's so annoying. I'm going to put this, I'm eating my salad right now that we made, but I'm going to put this like in the front because I like to put my jewelry not towards the back. The, I'm mixing metals. I do mix metals because I usually wear gold on my wrist no matter what. Well, it's not really true. That's why I was wearing the silver. I don't know. I mix metals. I don't care. These are my grand bracelets. I love them so much. And I feel like they look really good with my Cartier. Um, I love this. Both sizes. They are so like thick and luxe and gorgeous. Love these. Um, sick. And then um, I'm wearing silver today, which is like very unusual. This is my H hardware chain. And I love it. You can wear it multiple ways. It's super unisex. There's these like big H hardware um, details throughout. Um, it comes, it's like a long chain, but you can wear it as like a long necklace. You can like tie it, whatever. There's wear as Larry. You can wear it like different positions. It's really pretty. And then I'm wearing my dream tennis necklace, just stacked, but see the H hardware everywhere. And this is my sterling silver dream tennis necklace, just stacked. So keeping it kind of simple today. Okay, so I'm gonna grab, I boiled some potatoes and I'm just gonna grab some. I don't know how many I'm gonna use, but I'm taking them out of the colander. And I don't know how I'm gonna look over here, but okay. I hate, well, you guys know I don't like being from afar. I feel like I look better. I know there's a brush here. I, I don't care. I'm making myself lunch in my motherfucking home. I'm sure you guys have little fucking, I'm sure you have like diapers full of shit. Okay, I've seen your houses. I've seen your fucking houses. The nerve of you to tell me about a brush. Ugh. You guys have like boogers, kid kids with boogers running down their fucking mouth and noses. And you're gonna tell me about my brush? Do you see what, do you see how you guys irritate the fuck out of me? Okay, so um, let's make the salad. And when we're making, okay, this thing, like I don't know how I look because I don't like being afar. Like I need you to be up in my grill, literally for me to feel comfortable. <sighs> But, like, I can't check myself. I can't, like, I'm getting, like, really nervous. Okay. So, let me see. So, these are the greens that are previously washed. And I don't care. You don't agree. I don't give a shit. I'm over it. They're totally clean. Like, I get the fuck. You guys have some nerve. The rats have some nerve. Okay, so I'm just going to and then I'm gonna also do it that way. Okay. And we put these here. Okay, there. I don't even really like butter lettuce. I just didn't know, like I love iceberg, it's my favorite, but I didn't know like what would be good with that, with this. Okay, um, I, I don't know, I think potatoes, I like the idea of potatoes, so I'm just gonna half some potatoes 
these potatoes. Um, they're like the little mini ones. If you're not that hungry, the potato, you don't need the potatoes because they really like fill you up, but you guys know I love potato. And um, yeah, okay. So I was gonna rant about, or tell you guys about some topics. Do we not like the way I look? Do I look like, yeah, okay, I feel better. I just feel like a blob, right? I'm literally giving like fat graphic Contessa. Okay, so um, anyway, there. That, and then, yeah, snappies. Okay, so um, have you guys noticed on some people, I, it's like really weird. I know you guys are not mad at me, I don't care, you guys know. I'm gonna keep reminding you, this is a, um, like a FaceTime, and you're talking to your friend. This is how I do this. If you're an offended rat, then I don't know why you're here. Get out of here, as if you're so holier than thou. Do you see what I mean? As if like you are such a, go a good person that you never say anything about anyone. Like, give me a fucking break. Okay, I'm gonna do these at an angle because I think it matters. And the same thing with that, I'll show you. Like, it can't be straight, it needs to be like this. Let me show you. It needs to be like that shape, okay? If it's not that shape, it's just gross. Like, it's just not right for the salad, okay? Like, it's very, I feel like it's very Frenchy at an angle. Okay. Um, anyway, have you guys noticed people with fat teeth? Like, it's actually a thing, and it's starting to like, <laughs> like, I'm starting to notice it a lot. Um, you guys know what I'm talking about, right? The people, the real people out there who aren't like holier than that, this, this fucking knife is such shit. It's like dull as fuck. Oops. Um, great. Now I ruined it. I ruined those. I've, okay. I'm like, I have a couple people, whatever, who I've seen with the, f the fattest teeth, like fat teeth. One of them, they were just like crusted in a, do you guys remember when like those yellow teeth, those rats with like yellow teeth always come for me and I always like, I used to call them out, but like I can't repost people on Instagram because then I get like shut down. So they can bully me, but I can't, I cannot post a photo of them with their big crusty yellow teeth. <sighs> anyway, um, that one was, should be thrown out because it was not at an angle, to be honest. Dude, this is like, I have to just throw this away and it's broken too. Okay. So that's that. I don't, I don't want all this. The, the fat, like, is that the new thing? Instead of like yellow teeth, now they have like, it's, it's like, it's not even, sometimes it's people who, um, sometimes it's people who don't brush their teeth and then they have like, just like really thick, like build up of like yellow crust, which I've seen. And it's just, it's so vile. Like I'm, I'm not even joking. Have you seen that? I, I saw it like on Instagram a couple times, like recently. So I just wanted to bring it up. Okay, this one too, angle. See what I mean? At an angle, it just makes a difference, okay? And different like recipes call for like different shapes of food or it's just disgusting. So it has to be like at an angle. Um, you could put avocado in here too, but I did the potatoes, which is less, least cal less calories. So um, you don't need both. Stopping pig. Fuck this knife. Just try to, try to take my nail off. Okay, um, uh, okay, so it's either that or, okay, the, the stamp, oh, the dill is really important. So the dill, I know I didn't, I, I didn't wash this, honestly, I don't care. I don't care, like I just, fuck off. So I like a lot of dill. Um, so it's either that or it's like just people, I don't know if it's like um, veneers, or if it's just bad jeans, um, but these huge, thick teeth. I honestly don't, I don't get it. Like, I'm really confused. Um, so that, I wanted to bring that up to you because I wonder if you guys saw it. And I like, you guys love, you guys love when, you know you do? You love to like, guess who I'm talking about. That's what you do, you love it. So fucking pathetic. Okay, so, and then like that. And then I'm gonna do the dressing. Oh my God, this looks so good. And I'm gonna do some cracked salt, I that Maldon salt. And to be honest, I'm not a big Maldon salt fan. Like, I'm not, I know everyone loves it. It's like, I don't know, too crunchy or something. I don't love it, I don't know. <sighs> okay, like that. I need to wrap the napkin. Um, 
Hold on. Oops, I just like knocked you guys. Okay, then um, I'm gonna make a little vinaigrette with a half of, oh my God, she's using the same, the same knife for a lemon now. That's what you do. That's the, like, that's a shit that you do. Okay. Um, there's a seed here. So I'm gonna do a lemon. a lot of lemon especially with them um, anything with locks okay and then just some olive oil it's not not gonna be a lot I don't even really need olive oil and you do need a little bit that's it okay then my fork and I'll get some should I put mustard in it I don't know I'm not like a I might have ruined it. I don't, it's, it kind of complicates things for me. Like this is a very simple salad. Um, okay. It's really good. So I'm just gonna drizzle this over. I don't like cracked pepper. I don't know why I like really fine pepper. Um, and then this is the Maldon salt. I have it in like in this little vintage footed cup. I don't know. I got this salt because everyone loves it, but that's too much. It's just too, like too heavy or something. I don't, I don't love it. I don't know why. I'm like the only one who doesn't like it. Here is the salad. I know the blue potato had to show up, even though I don't know why. Like, okay, there's the salad, looks so good. Um, let me have a bite with you. Okay, so um, here it is. And I hope I didn't look disgusting from afar. I really like, hate that. Okay, let me have a bite. What did I just fling on myself? I could never do a cookie show. I could never. Okay, so I'm gonna get a piece of the cucumber and the lox. So good. This is definitely not one for the um, uncultured swine. Mm. Have you guys, okay, I know you're not gonna get it. Oh, you guys won't get it. There's a hotel called Hotel Coast, whatever. That's not how you pronounce it, I know. In um, Paris, and like, I love to go there when I'm there, and I'll, whatever. It's like super bougie and like so snobby. Like, I hate it, honestly. But their food is really good, and it's such a vibe. This, this salad is really giving that, honestly, I promise you. And if anyone who has been there will probably be like, yeah. They, this is very like giving that. Okay, so I'm gonna leave you guys with a final thought. And you guys know I just like have like little things that I like to mention um, on my channel too, whatever. Okay. You guys know how people are getting little tattoos everywhere which i actually do think is pretty and i think that that blogger kiara i think she kind of started that um by getting like just like little dainty tattoos everywhere and you guys know like i have hrh right here um i recently got it like i've never had a tattoo before and i don't regret it i mean i might regret it when i'm 80 like they always say but who knows can you not get a bow can you not get a fucking bow, okay? This whole like coquette thing or whatever, whatever, where you guys like, it's so trendy and like everyone's doing the fucking bow, I told you. You're like literally making bows out of your fucking pubes, okay? Like, can we just not do bows? Like do something else. I'm seeing everyone is doing these bow fucking tattoos now. And it is so dumb. It's so trendy. It is the dumbest shit ever. 
why don't you get something like that's more to you? What does a bow have to do with you besides the fact that it's like cool right now? Pathetic, okay? So embarrassing. Anyway, I'm giving you a warning for that because anyone with bow tattoos, it's just like, I don't know, it's so, it's so like, I had literally, it's like you go to a tattoo shop and you like pick something out of a book. Like really? You're gonna have that on your body for the rest of your life and it's literally out of a book. Or it's a, it's a fucking bow because that's what was like popular in spring of 24. Like so stupid. It's becoming like an epidemic. Like it really is. So I wanted to warn you guys of that in case you're too stupid to realize that that dumb idea, it's really dumb and to do something cooler, okay?